You're watching UNICEF Television. Clowning about for children. It's part of a new era in northern Sri Lanka and it's going down a treat. The smiles and laughter say it all. The company of clowns engage in the universal language of slapstick and daredevil climbing. Life here has been precarious during nearly 30 years of conflict. But two years of peace has generated fresh hope. Now it's a rare moment to relax and cool off. At the centre of it all are the team from the Cattle Ryan Trust of Ireland, opening new schools and health clinics. Without them, government and UNICEF, these new buildings wouldn't have been possible. A rousing reception. These children seek to rebalance their lives by learning in a safe and modern new school. For them, the trust is making a world of difference. The Cattle Ryan Trust is investing millions of dollars in education and health in northern Sri Lanka. This new school stands like a beacon in the landscape. It has 11 classrooms for 200 or more pupils between the ages of 6 and 16 who are clearly as pleased as punch with their new lives. At last, a permanent place of learning to call their own. 13-year-old Robin Sini told the Ryans, we had to move many times because of the conflict. Now though, we're proud. We're happy and we thank you for this wonderful school. I look at a, a building like this, in an area like this, it's just so full of possibilities and everything. You know, I, I'm, I'm very moved now. Hope's on the horizon as the dust settles over this island nation. A new maternity ward serving a population of 11,000 women and their babies. Sparkling and new antenatal and postnatal units, a labour room and sections for doctors and medical staff. All this means 24 hours care, seven days a week. The Trust wants to invest through UNICEF in Sri Lanka's children. I'm very impressed the way the country is progressing and, and a lot of that comes down to the people themselves. They want to get on with things and they are getting on with things. Um, there's amazing resilience in them and they just decide that life has to start from somewhere, you have to leave a certain amount behind. Um, and what we're just doing is trying to facilitate that in, in whatever way we can. We've spent a lot of time trying to listen as much as possible to what they've wanted. And they seem pleased, so I'm happy that they're pleased. The scars of conflict in Sri Lanka's north. The Cattle Ryan Trust is helping to heal. The significance of today is it clearly shows an example of a person who had a vision. And that vision was that if you want a prosperous Sri Lanka, if you want a peaceful Sri Lanka, you have to invest in its, in its children. And that's why by giving a good start with investment on health system and help them to grow to their full potential with the quality education, it helps with the future development, prosperity and the lasting peace of the country. Making her father's vision come true. The joy of realising a dream. This is not just about the foundations of buildings, it's about foundations for better lives. This is Mervyn Fletcher from Valnia, Northern Sri Lanka for UNICEF Television. For more information go to unicef.org. Unite for children.